Hello YouTube and welcome back to another Alpha Tech video. Today we're going to be looking at Oprah GX and the new splash screen and how to remove it. This thing. Oprah <laughs> GX! Ugh, god that thing sucks. Alright, so first thing I'm going to do is I'm just going to kill Oprah because I don't need it open. Uh, next thing we're going to do is we're going to jump into RPC. So we'll click on this fella and then we'll jump into users. From users we'll go into well, whatever your user folder is called. Um, the next thing we're going to need to do is we're going to need to locate the app data folder. Now for some of you guys this will be hidden so what you'll do is you'll go up to the view tab up the top here then you go across to your options when you got this little pop-up here, go to your view tab, and then under hidden files and folders, you'll go and select show hidden files, folders and drives, click apply, OK, and then you'll be able to see this hidden folder here. So from here, we'll go into the app data, uh, we'll go into local. Now from local, we're going to scroll down, and we're going to find uh, programs, which is here. So once we click on programs, you'll see Oprah GX. Now inside of this one, we're looking for this version of it here. So it ends in 4944.74. So we'll click on that one and then we'll scroll down the list and we'll have a look until we find this one here. So the application file for Oprah underscore GX underscore splash. So if you go ahead and delete that from that folder and we try to fire up Oprah GX now as you can see there is no splash screen so that's all I've got for you guys today uh, best of luck any questions leave them in the comments other than that yeah have a good day guys